The best-selling author behind Diary of a Wimpy Kid series is on a hot mess tour for the release <laughs> of his 19th book. Jeff Kinney has sold more than 290 million copies, inspiring movie and musical adaptations. And he's joining us this morning to tell us more about his upcoming trip to Chicago and Naperville. Hi, good morning, Jeff. How are you? Hi, it's great to see you. Yeah, great to see you. Thank you for joining us. So I must say that I am um, an adult fan of your books. I worked at a school for several years, and when I tell you that the kids love um, your series of books, um, yeah, it was just like the most popular uh, book around. So talk to us a little bit more about the main character, uh, was it Greg Heffley, and just why he's so engaging, why young people and adults like myself just love him so much. Well, it's so cool to hear that kids are still reading the books. You know, after 17 years of doing this, uh, my books are finding a new audience, which is really exciting for me. Uh, I think that kids can relate to Greg Heffley. He's got the same problems as everybody. He's got bullies and, and teachers and pets and, and pop quizzes, all these things that we, we have growing up. Uh, so I think that, you know, I go to China and to Taiwan, Korea, Brazil, and kids think of Greg Heffley as being one of them, which is really cool for me because it means that we have more in common than we do uh, un not in common. <laughs> I'm yeah. not very articulate today. Yeah, no, 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 absolutely. And speaking of uh, things in common, we're all a hot mess at times, <laughs> right? <laughs> Maybe <Sure>. currently. <laughs> all right, Maybe right. at this very moment, Jeff, you never know who you're talking to. <laughs> so talk to us more about your new book, and uh, you'll be in Chicago as well as Naperville over the next couple of days. Yeah, my new book is about what happens when you put too much family in a small beach house and add heat and food in a succession of power succession uh, struggle. And, and that's what you get. It's a recipe for disaster. Sounds like um, a good concept that didn't really pan out. A family yeah. vacation to a beach house. Yes, it's a bad idea, I think, in general. <laughs> Uh, but I'm going across the country in a in a food truck, and we're visiting um, underserved communities, handing out books, making sure we have diverse, high interest books that reflect the community uh, that that we're trying to serve. And we're also doing these big stage shows at, every night, so it's it's a blast. Awesome, awesome. And so, uh, talk to us a little bit more about what people can expect when they come to the show in Chicago or Naperville. Sure. The conceit of the show is that I'm getting out of the book business. I miss my calling. I should have been a restaurateur instead. <laughs> uh, so we try to open a restaurant that night on stage. Um, we hire waiters and we hire, uh, you know, back of house people, chefs, and everything goes wrong. Uh, so I won't spoil what happens at the end, but let's just say I have a change of heart. Okay. Right. That's amazing, Jeff. I, You know what? Your, your books have have taken over the imaginations of so many kids who are now adults. You must hear from them now, and some of them now have their own kids. Uh, what is that like to see this multi-generational impact you've had with your characters? It's, it's really cool. Your producer just said that she has kids in her in their mid-20s, and they were readers of mine. Uh, I got to see the full breadth of my readership because we did a statue unveiling of Greg Heffley at my alma mater, uh, the University of Maryland. And I got to see eight-year-old kids all the way up to 25-year-olds. And wow. it was really cool. It was really humbling and motivating to me, inspirational to me, and it makes me want to keep going. Now, Jeff, thank you so much. Do appreciate it. Good luck with the tour and your hot mess. Thank you so much. <laughs> all right. Thanks, thanks so much. Well, you can find the book at wimpykid.com. And again, thanks so much for joining us.